Ever wondered what could possibly destroy a common rail system? Today, we're going to explore just that. The common rail system is a modern fuel injection system for diesel engines. It's a key player in ensuring high efficiency and environmentally friendly operation. But, just like any other system, it doesn't come without its share of vulnerabilities. Breakdowns and wear and tear are part and parcel of any mechanical system, and the common rail system is no exception. This system is composed of several essential elements. A high-pressure fuel pump, a fuel distributor or rail, injectors, fuel pressure and temperature sensors, an electronic control unit, and fuel filters. Each of these components can falter due to a variety of reasons. So, buckle up as we take a deep dive into the details of what can break down a common rail system and how we can prevent or fix these issues. Let's delve deeper to understand what breaks down the common rail system and how to prevent these problems. First up, we have the high-pressure fuel pump. This unsung hero of the common rail system plays a pivotal role in the overall operation of your vehicle. It's tasked with the critical job of supplying fuel at high pressure, all the way up to 2,000 bars, to the fuel distributor. It's like the heart of the system, pumping life, or in this case, fuel, through the veins of your engine. But this pump, like any hard-working component, operates under heavy load and demands quality fuel. It's a bit of a connoisseur, you see. It prefers its fuel free of water, dust, and other particles. So you might ask, what happens when the pump doesn't get what it needs? Well, let's talk about one of the most common causes of pump failure, clogging or damage to its filter. This filter is the pump's personal bodyguard, shielding it from harmful contaminants. If the filter isn't replaced on time or if a subpar filter is used, abrasive particles can sneak into the pump. This intrusion can cause wear or even seizure of the pump parts. Now, Another cause of pump failure can be an insufficient fuel level in the tank or air in the fuel system. This leads to overheating and a phenomenon known as cavitation. Picture this. Cavitation is the formation of vapor bubbles in a liquid at a sudden drop in pressure. These bubbles, when compressed, burst and strike the pump surfaces, causing them to collapse. It's like a mini explosion inside your pump. So, how can you prevent these issues? The answer is simple quality fuel and timely filter changes. These are the keys to a healthy pump. Regular maintenance and care for your high pressure fuel pump can extend its life and ensure the smooth running of your vehicle. Remember, the key to a healthy pump is quality fuel and timely filter changes. Next, let's discuss the fuel distributor, also known as the rail. The rail is a central player in the common rail system acting as a conduit between the high-pressure fuel pump and the injectors. Imagine it as a busy highway, ensuring that fuel travels smoothly and efficiently from the pump to its final destination, the injectors. Fuel, under high pressure, is stored in this rail, ready to be distributed to the injectors at the perfect moment. The rail is also home to one or more pressure sensors. These little guys are essential, sending signals to the electronic control unit or the brain of the operation to adjust the functioning of the pump and injectors. So you see, the rail is not just a simple tube, but a complex and vital part of the system. But like any crucial component, the rail is not immune to failure. One of the common causes of rail issues is abrasive particles in the fuel. These pesky particles can have a damaging effect on the rail, much like a sandstorm etching away at a glass window over time. The walls of the rail, or the sensors within, can be damaged, compromising the smooth operation of the system. Pressure or temperature fluctuations can also wreak havoc on the rail. Picture a metal bridge in the midst of a heat wave, warping under the intense sun. Similar to that bridge, the rail can warp or even crack under extreme conditions. These failures can lead to fuel leaks or an inefficient fuel distribution, affecting the overall performance of the engine. To prevent rail failure, there are a few things you can do. Monitoring the quality of fuel and filters is key. Using low quality fuel or filters can introduce more of those abrasive particles we talked about earlier. Also, try to avoid overloading the engine and prolonged idling, as these can cause those harmful pressure and temperature fluctuations. So in essence, the rail is a vital highway in the common rail system, where fuel, 
under high pressure, is stored and distributed to the injectors. Keeping it in top condition is essential to maintaining the efficiency and longevity of your engine. To prevent rail failure, monitor the quality of fuel and filters, and avoid overloading the engine and prolonged idling. Moving on to the injectors, the devices that atomize the fuel. They may seem small, but they play a significant role in the operation of the common rail system. Each injector is equipped with minuscule holes, some as tiny as 0.1 millimeters, through which the fuel passes under high pressure. It's not hard to imagine that these devices are incredibly sensitive to fuel contamination and wear. Now, you might be wondering, what exactly can cause these injectors to falter? The usual suspects are dust, water, and rust particles. These contaminants can make their way into the injectors, causing them to clog up or jam. When this happens, the atomization of the fuel is affected, which is a fancy way of saying the fuel isn't being dispersed properly. This improper dispersion results in a number of problems. First, there's a noticeable reduction in power. It's like trying to run a marathon with a blocked nose. You're not getting the air you need and your performance suffers as a result. Similarly, when the injectors are not working optimally, the engine isn't getting the fuel it needs and its performance takes a hit. Next up, we have increased fuel consumption. When the fuel isn't atomized properly, the engine has to work harder, burning more fuel to compensate for the lack of efficiency. It's a bit like having to take longer strides when your shoes are too big. It's more work and less efficient. Lastly, we can't ignore the environmental implications. An engine with compromised injectors will produce an increased amount of emissions. That's more harmful gases being released into the atmosphere, contributing to pollution and climate change. So, as you can see, the health of the injectors is paramount to the overall performance of the common rail system. They may be small, but their role is vital, and their maintenance should never be overlooked. After all, a well-maintained injector is vital for optimal engine performance. In our exploration of the common rail system, we cannot overlook the importance of fuel pressure and temperature sensors. These sensors play a vital role in monitoring the parameters of the fuel within the system and transmitting this information to the electronic control unit. Their main function is to optimize the operation of the pump and injectors depending on the engine's operating conditions. Just like the other components we've discussed, these sensors are not invincible. They too can be affected by dirt, pressure and temperature fluctuations, humidity and corrosion. If these sensors fail or give incorrect readings, it can result in improper pump and injector operation, causing over- or under-fueling, reduced power, and increased emissions. These issues not only affect your vehicle's performance, but also its environmental impact. To prevent sensor failure, it's essential to regularly check the condition of the sensors and replace them if necessary. By doing this, you can ensure the optimal operation of your common rail system maintain your vehicle's performance and contribute to a cleaner environment. Next, we move to the heart of the common rail system, the Electronic Control Unit, or ECU. This is essentially a computer that controls the entire operation of the common rail system. It works based on data from not just the fuel pressure and temperature sensors we just discussed, but also from the throttle, detonation sensors, lambda probe, and other engine sensors. The ECU's primary role is to give commands to the pump and injectors. It tells them precisely when to deliver the fuel and in what amount, ensuring optimal engine performance and fuel efficiency. The ECU processes vast amounts of data in real time and makes rapid calculations to maintain the correct fuel delivery under various driving conditions. However, just like any other component, the ECU is not immune to failure. It can be affected by overheating, overvoltage, short circuits, moisture, and mechanical damage. If it fails, it can lead to significant issues within your vehicle, including suboptimal performance, higher emissions, and even complete engine failure. Therefore, it is crucial to regularly check the condition of the ECU and ensure it is functioning properly. By doing this, you can safeguard your vehicle's performance and prolong the life of your common rail system. Having understood the intricate workings of the common rail system, we now shift our focus to the importance of timely diagnosis and maintenance. The common rail system, 
as efficient as it is, is not immune to damage or malfunctions. These problems, if not addressed promptly, can have serious consequences on your engine's performance and even your safety. Regular checks of components like the ECU, injectors, fuel pump, and sensors are necessary to ensure they are functioning optimally. It is also important to follow the manufacturer's recommendations for vehicle operation and maintenance. This includes things like using the right type of fuel, changing the fuel filter at specified intervals, and keeping the engine in overall good condition. By doing this, you not only ensure the efficiency and longevity of your common rail system, but also contribute to the durability of your vehicle as a whole. Remember, a well-maintained vehicle is not just about performance, it's also about safety. So keep your vehicle and its common rail system in top shape, and enjoy a smooth, efficient, and safe drive every time.